Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Matthew Yates here. We are kicking it live in the High Fidelity Format Studio. A yeah, project I was working on this Father's Day. I was just chilling around the studio, doing what I what I love to do best. And happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. This is a joint I've been working on the last few days, and uh, I started it out in Ableton Live Nine Suite kind of got the foundation built there and then I exported it out of Ableton part by part piece by piece and pulled it into Sonar X2 and as you can tell on the right I'm using mix bus compression this is how I'm making my tracks on the daily now <clears throat> I listened to Don Tallman's I Believe in Love and how Frankie mixed that and I noticed like toward the end of the track where the music faded out and she was still singing and I was wondering how in the world did Frankie Knuckles pull that off he's using mix bus compression he's got all his parts routed to a bus and the vocals is routed to a separate bus from the music and you can pop the bus down you can pop the music bus down or whatever sound you want down and the vocals will still be in the track so, um, you know, I'm still learning as I grow. I try to teach myself new things and different things. I just got my, I've been practicing the piano and uh, synthesizer so I can do things a lot better. Um, I'm always watching tutorials to try to grow. I don't want to sound the same every time I put a record out. So as you can see, my CDs came in the mail from here and play right here and uh, I will be practicing because I play by ear anyway I can't read I play everything by ear all my tracks are accidents so four steps to next level playing is two CDs in here so I will be practicing this um, very soon I will be adding more to my piano playing skills real soon so I can make better material and also come up with better ideas and and uh, have a better feel for what I'm doing but so far I've been working on this joint here for the last what three four days three four days and I got it to a level now where well, I started it in Ableton I pulled it out of Ableton piece by piece track by track part by part and pulled it into Sonar X2 and I began to mix it and I'm using mix bus compression and uh, as you can see, uh, down here we have our drive. It's just like on the full mixing board. And we got our side chain channels for each mix bus compressor at the top. But this is what we come up with so far. Give it a little volume. So every time we make a track, we want it to be better than the last one. I'm talking about as production-wise as well as music-wise. Um, it's a lot I didn't know, and I'm still learning. I don't tend to sound the same every time you hear something from me. You may have, I mean, you may hear a little similar flavor from time to time, but... I'm seeking to learn what most won't tell you. I don't want to be a lazy producer. I want to be a good quality producer. Matthew Yates, 
Yeah. Be blessed. 